Hi there, and thanks for joining me at the Financial Spotlight. I'm Chantrell, and I'm here to give you financial tips and tricks that are going to help you on your road to know your money. And today, I wanted to talk to you about the 10 different tax deductions that you can take off as a truck driver. This is specifically for those who are 1099 truck driving employees that have no taxes taken out and they have to and they own their own trucks etc this is a video that's just for you so let's go ahead and get into all of the deductions that you can take as a truck driver so the first one that you can take obviously is your fuel and your maintenance so if you get repairs done to your truck and you constantly fix it or you have to do oil changes or all of those different things that you would do fixing your or repairing your your truck then these things can be written off on your taxes you would also deduct any required insurance so that could be cargo commercial liability and property damage insurance and then you're going to deduct things that um, help you to run your trucking business your equipment and your tools that could be tire chains tarps bungee cords tire irons flat jaw vice grips and motor oil make sure that you keep all of your receipts make sure that you are keeping track and itemizing each one of the items in your expenses and make sure that you are staying on top of the amount of times you have to change these out and update them and then number four you can write off your gps so that's basically the thing that you use to get around to show you exactly where you're going you can write off your cm radio the internet service that you use to run all of your you can write off your cm radio the internet that you use and the data fees that you pay to run this cb or your gps or your computers your eld and your cm radio so and then also your gps to get you from place to place Make sure that you are ready for tax season when you go see your tax preparer. They will love you for this. This tax binder will have you organized for tax time and all year long. Perfect for individuals, small business owners, and independent contractors. It includes instructions on how to use the binder, personal information worksheet, a business information worksheet, list of tax documents you will need to file taxes, current documents envelope with top closure mileage tracker a tax deduction checklist expense tracker receipts envelope three tax return envelopes zipper closure this binder is durable and it will protect all of your important doc documents from damage or loss once tax season is all over this binder will hold your tax records in the current tax document section for you to collect for the next year it will also hold your prior year's tax return safely so that you can refer back to them at any time and provide them for any financial reason like buying a home or getting a business loan order yours today now your number five deduction is your truck lease payments. So if you are making payments to your for your truck and you are making them regularly, then 
you need to go ahead and write those off on your taxes as well. Next is going to be your tolls and your parking fees. So if you pay to go over um, bridges or through tolls or anything like that, you need to go ahead and write those off. Same thing when it comes to parking fees. If you are parking in parking garages or parking at meters or anything like that, you need to make sure that you write that off on your taxes too. And then the seventh thing that you can write off is your health insurance. So of course, when you are working for yourself, self-employed or a 1099 employee, usually you do not get any medical coverage. So if you are paying for your own health coverage through um, a hospital or through a plan, then definitely put that on your taxes as a write-off. Well, don't fret because I have a free, yes, I said a free tax deduction list plus a guide to guide you through and tell you every single deduction and exactly why and how you write it off on your taxes. Go ahead and download that today. Link is down below in the description box. You'll thank me later. Now, a special thing that you can write off are association fees. Sometimes you pay association fees or union dues so that you can get discounts on certain things or so that you can become a member of a union so that they could get you contracts, etc. Then you can definitely write that off on your taxes. Next, you need to be keeping track of your heavy highway vehicle use tax. So a lot of truck drivers are charged this use tax. And if you are charged that tax, it is imperative that you keep um, a tab of that, a tally of it. Make sure you have receipts. Make sure that you are writing down all of that information. And last but definitely not least are your office expenses. This can be desk that you use to be in your office, software, printers, supplies, anything that you use to run your office or run your business, you can write those off on your taxes as well. Hey, have you had a chance to join the family yet? If not, go ahead and click the subscribe button and join the family today and also turn on those notifications so that you can know exactly when we're going to post here on the Financial Spotlight channel. All those juicy financial tips and tricks for you, we'd love to have you. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to get more information on other tax deductions that you can take, then go ahead and watch this video right here. Thank you for joining us at the Financial Spotlight and have a good one.